Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today we have an interesting issue that has raised the worldwide community's interest. Prepare to be surprised as we plunge into the surprising turn of events surrounding how Turkey has America and China in shock with this mega project. Turkey is really developing a top-notch project. Let's embark on this interesting journey together. As we uncover the amazing story of how Turkey has America and China in shock with this mega project, we will discover the fascinating considerations that inspired these major projects as we dig into the fascinating world of the makers. Join us as we examine and know if there is more to the story than joining us on this journey. Kindly subscribe to the YouTube channel and stay tuned to discover the reality behind this. Today, there are several large hydropower projects being implemented in Turkey. We're going to talk about two of them today. Let's start with a hydroelectric dam that's being built on the main stem of a crucial river in the Black Sea province of Orphan, and then demonstrate how the Turks are constructing the greatest suspension bridge in the world. Sadly, the town of Valley, which is 8 kilometers or 5 miles from the dam being built, will have to be submerged when the massive hydroelectric power plant is finished. It should be noted that since ancient times, people have built structures to block the flow of water that is then used for agriculture. Modern constructions are undoubtedly a wonder of architecture and technology. They contain enormous walls with sousas engaged, in contrast to the older dams which are less in size. In the case of Eli Dam, which will be used, its height will be 270 meters, making it the highest dam in Turkey and the seventh highest dam in the world. They're constructed across the river simultaneously, and the taller the dam, the bigger its reserve capacity. The construction of the dam, which is of the concrete arch type, began on December 21, 2012. It'll be the second largest dam in the larger Corky River Development Plan, which calls for the construction of 13 dams, eight of which are currently operational and more are being built. The dam is controversial due to its predicted impact on biodiversity within its reservoir and the relocation of local residents. If we talk about a hydroelectric power plant, it'll produce 1.9 billion kilowatt hours. The primary purpose of the dam is the production of hydroelectric power. It'll support a 540 megawatt power plant. 650,000 people's demands may be satisfied by hour, which has a total capacity of 558 megawatts. The new hydropower project constructed in the Orphan province of northeastern Turkey will boost the country's economy by more than $221 million a year. The dam, which was totally constructed by Turkish engineers, is located 70 kilometers or 44 miles southwest of Arvin Yusuf Ali. It is a twin curt arch dam with a height of 270 meters from the base and 213 meters from the river's lowest point. At the same time, it'll feature a peak that's 15 meters high and 490 meters long. It'll be made of 4 million cubic meters of concrete, which is equivalent to the amount needed to construct 50,000 homes. The crest of the dam will rise to a height of 750 meters above sea level, while the reservoir's regular operating level is 710 meters, with a maximum and low of 712 meters and 670 meters respectively. The reservoir will have a total storage capacity of 2 billion cubic meters and cover an area of 33 square kilometers. 1 billion cubic meters of storage will be active or usable. The dam spillway will be a spillway with an 8,000 cubic meter maximum capacity. In the underground power plant, which is 110 meters long, 21 meters wide, and 45 meters high, three Francis turbines with a vertical shaft of 110 megawatts will be installed as part of the construction of the dam, which will require the porting of over 3 over 3,000 cubic meters of concrete. A specific system has been created in the construction site for the massive construction equipment. And today, water storage and electricity generation will commence. The dam is also undergoing final checks before it begins to function. Tons of construction equipment may be moved through the air or erected from slope to slope with the aid of a cable crane system. A total of 560 billion kilowatt hours of power will be produced annually once the LE dam is fully operational. With the usage of Valley Hydroelectric Dams, the nation's hydroelectric power output capacity will rise by 2%, allowing it to cover the early energy needs of a big city like Antonio at its installed capacity of 1 megawatt. The dam, which is considered to be an engineering marvel, will be remembered in history as a massive undertaking demonstrating the Turkish people's indomitable spirit. 
The project not only constructed the dam, but also 108 kilometers or 60 miles of roads, 45 tunnels, 22 bridges, and 92 covers. The country's economy will benefit from a project that will generate $83.5 million a year and pay for itself in seven years. Turkey's relationship with the Dardanelles has always been crucial. The stretch measures 120 kilometers or 75 miles, one and a half miles and just four kilometers broad. The Dardanelles provide a canal between the Mediterranean Sea and the Black Sea, giving resource-rich nations access to the rest of the globe. Despite their prominence, the Dardanelles serve as the boundary between Europe and Asia together with the nearby Bosphorus Strait. Only three bridges connected the continents until the year 221, and they were all in Istanbul, where for the first time, traffic bottlenecks both on the ocean and on land were possible. In order to address the issue, the Turkish government attempted to construct a bridge in 1988. However, owing to a combination of political and economic factors, progress was halted in 1995 more than 20 years later, and in 2016, the Turkish government resumed the project. A local group of construction firms and South Korean enterprises secured the contract a year later. In order to adapt the 40 meters of special waterproof support, a few cases were loaded in September of 17. The combined weight of each case was 59,000 tons. They had steel frames to withstand earthquakes, and unique platforms made of the same material were built on top of each of them to serve as the basis for a bridge with a height of 318 meters. Actually, the 1915 bridge is a contender for the title of suspension bridge with the biggest average span in the world, with a center span of 23 meters. There are 4,608 meters of bridges in all. 126 wires are said to be contained in each of the 296 steel cables, each of which is 4,330 meters long, and which together make up the main ropes of the Shana'a Bridge. To create the major wires, we are employed. 25,000 miles or 40,000 kilometers, or four times the circumference of the Earth, is the length of wire use in steel cables. One suspension bridge is part of the highway and bridge building project, and it provides access to $5 reinforced concrete viaducts. There are six subterranean bridges, 38 overpasses, five bridges, 43 underpasses, and 115 covers of varying sizes. There are 12 junctions total, including the National Highway Crossing, that makes it easy to go to maintenance and operating centers. China actually bridged 1915 is distinguished by the following. It has six lanes, three going forward and three going back, a length of 3,860 meters, a distance of 2,230 meters between the two column towers, and a total of 2,230 meters of width. The longest bridge in the world, the Shinalco A Bridge, was built in 1915, and it cuts the time it takes to drive between the two banks in half, from an hour and a half to six minutes. The bridge is supported by two bases that are each 313 meters long, and each side of the structure has towers that are 388 meters high, which is higher than the Eiffel Tower's height of 300 meters. $85 million will be saved annually overall. Large ocean-going boats may travel freely beneath the bridge since the bottom portion of the roadbed is around 70 meters above the water. There are a number of issues in the region where the bridge is located, including multi-tiered container ships, heavy winds, high waves, and a lot of activity. Strong winds are always a concern for a suspension bridge with a long span, so to ensure the aerodynamic stability of the bridge, a double whole body design was adopted. As previously mentioned, very large container ships and cruise ships pass beneath the bridge, so the design took the risk of collision with ships into account. On the Asian and European coasts, it is minus 45 meters and 37 meters respectively. This massive building project was completed in a record-breaking four years. The project ended up costing 2 billion 545 million euros. 1,100 persons and 740 pieces of construction machinery were employed in the building of the Chin Bridge in 1915, which would link the European and Asian coasts of the Dardanelles for the first time. Turkey will be able to save 450 million euros annually on gasoline emissions thanks to the Dardanelles Bridge. Experts estimate that the bridge over the Dardanelles would have a beneficial economic impact on Turkish industry of up to 5.5 billion euros annually. The economy will grow by 2.5 billion euros, and there will be a 100,000 employment rise. 
but the most crucial development is that the Chin Bridge of 1915 will be used as a detour route from Istanbul to the country's southeastern provinces. Trucks, buses, and cars won't have to wait in line for ferries, which will eventually make it easier to transport people between Asia and Europe. It'll also enable the growth of international tourism and shorten the time it takes for goods to be delivered from the west and northwest of the country to these regions. They would be transported back and forth via the Dardanelles to Turkey's Asian region. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating trip as we've successfully looked at how Turkey is American China in shock with this mega project. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more fascinating insights into the world of mega China projects.